cave now. And which leads into here. And last time that chair wasn't here before. Okay. So this is actually where the first house is. Where we can't go back. That's the old woman. Is that chair gone again? No. Last time we went. Okay then. This is where we realized Mia was changed. So I think we're near to the end of Resident Evil. And Zoe's not on the phone anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Is your fault. Why am I seeing this? I'm guessing in every we can go for those. Get them. So Evelyn is blaming me. <laughs> me. Ethan, oh, it's okay. It's okay, it's me. I know you didn't mean to hurt me. Kill him, Mommy. Oh, but you shouldn't have done that! It fucking hurts! He doesn't want to be my daddy? Then he can die. Now it's Mommy's turn to kill you! What do you mean? Evelyn? <laughs> Evelyn, what are you talking about? You said you didn't want her anymore. <laughs> You're gonna be one of us. And then maybe you'll play nicely. I'm not playing. No! Get that away from me! I don't need your pity! Okay. You don't understand. Whoa, that's a big doll. Yeah. I need to shot her. <laughs> That'd be bad. Okay. I don't want to hurt you. Evelyn. Get away from me! Stop! 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 
No! No, stop it, Evelyn! No, no, no. Come here! I'm Redfield. I'm glad we found you. Chris Redfield? Wait, what? The fuck took you guys so long? Did I? I'm so 
Yes, you're a dead! What? They say that when one door closes, another opens. Well, a door closed tonight. And what a long night it was. But not just for me. Me and I weren't the only victims here. So were the Bakers. It was that thing, Evelyn, who made them that way. But now Evelyn's dead. And these guys are here to clean up the mess. I had just come to terms with losing Mia. But now she's back and wants to start over. Put all this behind us. Maybe this is where the next door opens. Hey, we saved Mia! Yes, well, what the hell is this? Credits and bit of pictures and all, and some um, playing music. I don't know if it's gonna be copyright now, but hopefully it's not because I did the gameplay. So that's the ending. We saved Mia. I thought I thought she was gone. I thought she was dead. But it looks the like was wrong. Maybe that was a good ending. Just going back to choosing Zoe or Mia. And I chose Mia because we came here for Mia. So if we picked Zoe, would that be the bad ending? And Mia wouldn't be there or something? Like, it's a good thing I actually chose a good ending. I am quite happy about that. And it's, like, I think there's supposed to be like a... Um, a sequel, something or a different type of game, and I'm actually quite surprised that Chris Renfield was announced, like at the end with the helicopter, and it's still based on the actual Resident Evil. I quite like this music, and it's really good. Like I love the ending. These people have put tons of effort to make this game much better as it is now and it's been amazing like i enjoyed this game so much and like we did have a few jump scares and i took a special uh, time where i shot the shotgun and scared myself but that doesn't count as the original like so good is actually uh, for that and i'm quite happy that we saved Mia. So, uh, here's the credits. Here they're rolling. So, I'm actually going to still record these because, you know, I've got to keep the credits in because these people have actually put tons of work into this game. Like, with the. Uh, the like the normal Resident Evils, you play as like uh, Leon, Chris, other characters from the original Resident Evil, but now you're this new guy called Ethan, and you don't know what he looks like. Like Ethan is just a mystery now. Like we haven't actually seen seen his face. Like when um, Mia was chucking us in that room in the back flash flashback, I was trying to see if I could see his face, but I just couldn't. I don't know if he's supposed to be. It's a mystery dude. Something like that. So that, that's amazing. Like, I love how the story went. There's tons of things to talk about. 
a lot of things. Like, now we just figure out that Evelyn is that grandma this whole time. And that's why she was in the chair at first when we walked into the actual house that we were before. And of course, then we got flashbacks of Mia trying to attack us. And when we were going to the attic, she attacked us like three or four times. Or trying to, let's say. So I think that would be an instant death if we can block those. Something like that. But luckily, I had enough health things, I guess. But I don't know if I'm supposed to be shooting that face at the start or save it up for the ending and that pistol is really strong that's a one of the end that lucas gave us i think lucas is now free as well i'm not quite sure or he still got it and zoe or did they die that's that's the thing i'm thinking about did zoe and lucas survive or did they die did they shoot them because they were still infected or are they now cured because Evelyn is no more? That, that's one thing I want to know about. So I might um, do some research or something. If I got time, you know. Um, <clears throat> so yeah. I know I've skipped a lot of things because my recording set didn't exactly upload properly. So there's a few videos that's been missing. So... Yeah, um, I don't know what to really say now because the credits are still going, and it, I just love the whole game. I like the idea, the mystery thing, and we were there for Mia, and at the end we saved Mia, and that, which I was really happy about that we saved Mia because we were there for Mia, and if we did save her and she was still in the house, Live or dead, then I would be sad. Because <laughs> Ethan came all the way through the nightmares, not just to lose Mia, but just to save her. And he did. He saved Mia. Well, I'm just happy that Mia's not dead. And they are starting a new life. And probably Mia's not gonna do her job anymore. Even though she knows about it, but she might not tell. Actually, that depends. I'm not quite sure. Now I'm just rumbling about stuff now, but... Um, this credit's just too long. How many people are involved in this? It's gotta be coming to the end. Gotta be. Uh, does everybody hate it when credits keep them going very long and long and sort of thing? But it's there's so many people involved in these games that they should be mentioned. I know that. people have made a game that's connected to horror and I would say that's horror and people say they can't play it but the fact is If you guys want to, I should have said this, uh, if you don't want to see the credits, you can just skip half the credits.
Chesling? Is that the new, is that the next one? Hey, we did it! Hopefully you enjoyed. Cloak Susie's out for now.